Well, one of the most common problems our members have is looking for grant money to help pay rent. <laughs> and I think there's more and more people in that uh, situation nowadays because, man, rent's going up, uh, prices are going up, and rent's going up seems faster than anything. Housing prices are going up. So uh, housing is a big problem. And, and don't forget, any time the, uh, the country has a problem, the, uh, the politicians try to solve it by giving money away, okay? Uh, so it was like that with rent. And during COVID, it was very popular. There was a real big problem uh, program that was in COVID. And it was run by an organization that, that is in every state called the National Association of uh, uh, F uh, Financial Assistance Agency. <laughs> Housing Financial Assistance Agency. Uh, so that's in every program. And here's their website. is ncsha.org. Okay, and you see a state-by-state -state listing of all the programs. Now, this is, they kept track of the COVID rent programs, and there's still some of that around. Not a whole lot, but that was easy to help with rent problems because there was a one big enchilada, uh, and a lot of that money is going away. But if you're looking for a rent, I would check there first because they'll also know about new ones, okay? And that's what's important. Uh, you want to know about new programs all the time. So that's it. You go to this website, ncsha.org, and you look for rental emergency rental assistance, and you look in your state, you click on your state, and call them. You have to call for anything. Now, this isn't very much in use right now, but it's worth trying, and particularly if you have nothing. If you have an easier way to get money, you go do it, baby. Don't even watch the rest of this, okay? <laughs> Because these are probably going to take some work. The next thing you do uh, is go to HUD.gov, H-U-D dot G-O-V slash counseling. And they help you with any kind of problem with housing. If you can't pay your rent, you can't pay a down payment, you can't pay a mortgage or whatever, or you're looking for a house, or you have credit problems, and that stops you uh, from getting a mortgage or renting a place and things like that. They sit down with you for free and fix your credit. How do you like that? They sit down with you for free and fix your credit, all for free. You don't know that. They don't advertise, and you'll never find them in Google. Please don't go to Google, okay? That's just going to waste your time, money, and, and probably drain your bank account without solving any problems. So stay out of Google. If you're going to look at any websites, they should all end in gov, dot gov or dot org. ORG means they're a nonprofit organization. So HUD.gov, see that's G-O-V, slash counseling, you go there and click on, uh, you know, how to get free help. <laughs> and, and you have a listing of all the, or, here's the housing counseling agencies. You go there, put in your zip code and make an appointment. And make an appointment with more than one, two, three, whatever. You get, learn more knowledge about this problem. This is a problem that was with you for a long time, probably going to be with you for a lot longer. Okay, so the more you learn from pe free people who solve problems like yours every day, man, the more you become a fit, the faster you become a superhero. Okay, what else is there? The, another great organization is findhelp.org. This is in every city, okay? And what they do is keep track of all the nonprofit organizations that give money, that give money for anything, whether it's food, housing, goods, transit, healthcare, money, care, education, work, or legal, all of them free. You put in your zip code, like for my zip code, there's over 3,900 organizations in all those subjects that give it for free. Okay, uh, so if you want to know about where you live, okay, I put in one here. Here's for Houston. I put in now, after you put in your zip code for Houston, then you put in rent for the keyword. Okay, in Houston, there's 88 nonprofit organizations that help you with rent. 88. So get out of Google. You go, you're going to get 200 million websites there, and every one of them, unless these 88 out of 200 million, you'll never find. So there's 200 million, less 88, all are going to want money from you because they have to pay Google to find you, okay? So that's what Google's about, making Google money. And then having you pay money 
to the people who advertise. So you want to stay out of there. Unless you have money, God bless you. Go do it. Okay. So that's just for uh, Houston. 88 places for rent. Okay. Uh, now, another thing you want to do is uh, this organization called Just. J-U-S-T Shelter. S-H-E-L-T-E-R. Okay. And you go there and you put in your uh, state number. And here, for Texas, uh, there are... 24 organizations, no, I'm sorry, there are 28 organizations that give free legal help so you don't get evicted, okay? If you're worried about evicting, no matter where you are in the process, it's just a glimmer of you don't know because the more you know about eviction, the better you feel because you'll know your rights and you know that people can't just kick you out of the house willy-nilly, okay? You, they can't do that to you and you need legal help to stop that. And if you have to go to court, you go to court with these people because you win. If you go to court with a lawyer, unfortunately, <laughs> you win and you can get a free lawyer. Really, you win 70% of the time, the data I've seen on that. And that's pretty common because yeah, usually you show up without a lawyer, your landlord has a lawyer, and he knows the law, how to push the right button and get you screwed over and out in the street. You gotta know the law on your side that prevents them from doing it. If nobody says they can't do it, they're gonna do it. So you, that's why right. you need that help to protect you. Now, I also did this for, uh, 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 t uh, Tampa, Florida. Now, Tampa, Florida, uh, on JustShelter.org, they have uh, 28 lawyers that are available. So, no, they have 24. Uh, Houston has 28. Uh, Tampa has 24. But also, uh, oh, no, that's not there. <laughs> but go, go and find help again. Let's go on Find Help. I'll show you. Okay, this is for, let's start over on Find Help. Okay, put in a zip code. Let's put in uh, Tampa. Okay, 33590. See, it's very simple to do. And then when that comes in, oh, it doesn't like that zip code. That means I started the wrong place. Let's go Find Help. See, I just got and at my age, man, I know I'm, I'm willing to scale her up a lot. 33590. See, it's simple. And even an 81 year old could do this. <laughs> now it says it doesn't like me anymore. Don't, don't you hate that when you're making a presentation? <laughs> and find help. There's something I have in there. It's best to just have you tried re rebooting, unplugging, and starting again? So findhelp.org. Put in the zip code, uh, three, uh, three, four, oh, you know what, I did? I was putting the wrong zip code number. <laughs> three, three, five, uh, three, three, five, nine, oh. Okay, then I put in rent, R-E-N-T. Oh, there's no dash in that. Uh, gosh darn it. Kind of keep wanting to put a dash in, that screws it up. Okay, 69 places in Tampa that help with free rent. That's right. A lot of people that are members, they go, oh, I called for trying to get a rent grant or whatever, and they said there were no more money. You know, whatever. Or, have you called 69 places? No, you probably haven't, right? That's what you got to do. And if the people you talk to say they have no money, well, then say, hey, okay, where else can I do? Because that's how you find the real good stuff that nobody else knows about because it just started or things like the rent programs are starting every day. They're not here like since the history of man from, or from, <laughs> from uh, 200 years ago when the country started. No, they're coming and going all the time. So that's why you have to pay attention uh, and you get the people. The best way to find out about this is talking to people who help people like you with that problem. And those people are there for free to help you. But you don't know that right? So you think the world is normal. No, this is the government. This is not normal. <laughs> Don't think normal. In fact, oh, the government should be this way. And God damn it, <laughs> that's the way it should be. No matter what you think the government sh should be, it ain't. And you have to figure out what it is if you want to use it, okay? <laughs> and that's what it is. Uh, you have to figure out what it is and use what it is. Otherwise, you're going to go home crying and not solve your problem. You've got to solve the problem, and that means not giving up. So that's why, you, uh, worst case, you've got to call 69 people about their rent program. And all but one or two or maybe three of them will say you're not eligible. See? 
but that's gonna happen. You think there's magic in the world? No, <laughs> there's just stamina. <laughs> and anybody could have stamina. Magic's a little too tricky. <laughs> Nobody could guarantee you get magic, okay? But you can get stamina. Anybody could do that. So out there and get that stamina. <laughs> Did I say that right? Is that the right goddamn word? <laughs> and that's what we do at Let's Go Help because, you know, uh, for our $20 monthly free, you could ask us 100 questions a day if you want. We have live people to answer your questions uh, online, on video, uh, uh, workshops, live members who just got money like you want, you know, and they show you how they get it. And that's what's cool. You know, uh, nobody else in the world. For $20, man, you could do this all. And there's a, actually Sunday night, uh, there's a wonderful member who helps people boost their credit score by two, 300 points sometimes. So do that. Stay out on Google. <laughs> and what we also do is give out our own grants. That's right. We go over $75,000 a month, every month of members in grants so that you don't have to pay back. $75,000. That's what we do. I'm, I'm shocked that we're able to make any money at all as a profit, uh, paying, uh, charging only $20. Everybody said, no, I have to charge $200,000, $500,000, all this kind of stuff. No, I didn't want to be that guy. I want to be the $20 guy, the people who really need the money. I don't want to help people who don't need money. <laughs> <laughs> That's what, <laughs> I had many businesses who did that. I charged a lot of money. They don't even need the goddamn money. I find them. You know, I want to help the people who really need the money. I'm going to do this for the rest of my life, and I'll be here. And when you don't see me here anymore, it means I'm under the ground. Well, probably not. My ashes will be thrown somewhere. <laughs> who knows where? I don't care. I won't be here. <laughs> so please uh, take care of yourself. The organizations, the help is out there, but it's not the way you think it is. So start learning. It's easy. You learn to ride a bike. You learn to drive a car. You learn the computer. You can learn this shit. It's only the government. 